the Lakers get back on the winners list as they beat the Magic 129 to 110. The Lakers were leading at halftime 65 to 55. I thought the start of this game was ugly from both teams. Both teams seemed to struggle to score. Uh, it was just a little uh, poor from both sides, I would say. But then it was great to see the Lakers' three-point shooting starting to kick in throughout the game. They made 17 uh, three-pointers out of their 43 that they put up. The Magic made 10 three-pointers in this one. The rebounds, the Lakers out-rebounded the Magic 46 to 37. Uh, even though LeBron James struggled from downtown, he was 0 out of 7 from the three-point arc. He had some nice shots. He finished up with 28 points. He had 12 in the first half, 7 rebounds, and also 5 assists. Russell Westbrook had a great game. His 197th career triple-double, 13 rebounds, 13 assists, 15 points. Well done, Russell Westbrook. Uh, and he's just three off from triple-double, number 200. Well done to Russ. A great game from him. I thought Patrick Beverly had a nice game, and it was because he gave this team kind of a, a nice start. He was shooting threes and he was knocking a couple down. He was 4 out of 10 from downtown. So although he put up quite a few threes, uh, he made a few big ones at times. Two rebounds, two assists, 14 points. He had 11 in the first half. Troy Brown Jr., one rebound, one assist, 15 points. He was 3 out of 4 from downtown and he really knocked down his threes in that fourth quarter to close this game out. That was really what I was impressed with. The Lakers closed this game out really strongly. And Thomas Bryant, a nice double-double, 10 rebounds and 21 points. He also had one assist. For the Magic, Franz Wagner had two rebounds, four assists, 15 points. Bol Bol had five rebounds and 10 points. And Wendell Carter Jr., three rebounds, four assists, 15 points. Moritz Wagner and Paolo Banchero were both in foul trouble throughout the game. Wagner had four and... Uh, Banchero had five fouls, so it's really tough to get those players in the game and kind of have an effect when they're in a lot of foul trouble and spent most of the time on the bench. Like I mentioned, great to see the Lakers shooting their threes. Still needed to pick up on defense at times, but what I really liked in this game uh, was the Lakers' fast break, their awareness at times, and the teamwork, the assisting. The Lakers out-assisted the Magic 32-25. to 25. It was great to see, uh, you know, players like Russell Westbrook, uh, LeBron James, the assists were just so beautiful at times. Great plays, and how's the assist from Austin Reeves for the alley-oop hook pass over the head to LeBron for the jam. It was showtime for the Lakers, and in that fourth, they wrapped this one up. Love to see it. Lakers next game tomorrow at 11.30 a.m. when they take on the Miami Heat. Go, Lakers. All right, guys, if you like that recap and you want to see more of my content, remember to hit that thumbs up, like, comment, and hit that red button down there that says subscribe. Much appreciated. For more content, follow me on my Facebook page and also my Instagram page.